Hey everybody, Jamie Bond, Fish Blue Water. Thanks for joining us. I'm here with my very good friend Ian Hall from Florida, HuntingAdventures.com, and my two boys, Riley and Braden. So this is my second time here, Ian. Uh, came out with some buddies uh, and we did your first ever tower pheasant hunt, which was an absolute blast. We had great weather then. God has blessed us with a beautiful day today. And so I've got them here to go on their first ever quail hunt. And uh, we just went through the program a little bit while I was enjoying a cup of coffee and some pastries, which Susan, thank you very much. Beautiful touch here. Um, and um, so I was surprised to hear you tell me that skeet shooting is a standard part of this package, yeah, sure that's which correct. for these guys and myself who don't do a lot of this type of shooting, I think it's going to be a lot of fun and a good little warm-up uh, for the package. But this is this is standard, right? That's correct, Jamie. We offer a complimentary warm-up skeet shoot. We call it a simulated bird shoot or a simulated wing shoot. Mm -hmm. It's standard for all our quail hunts. One of the things you're going to notice in our quail hunts, we slow it down a little bit. We're not trying to get you in and out of four or five hours. We take our time. We don't rush it. And it's it's it's, it's low, you know, low pressure and. So we are allowed to be able to do this time-wise and not be rushed, letting you warm up. And it's complimentary, part of the package. I love it. So uh, I think you're going to be in for a great treat today in this video. We're going to show you some behind the scenes stuff that I'm certain um, that you've probably never seen before in these types of videos. And maybe even pick up some pointers and some tips if you're thinking about doing something similar on your own property. So enjoy the video and uh, we're excited to get it started. So, obviously this is awesome. The dogs are beyond excited. I see nibbling my uh, finger. How, how do you decide which dogs get to go? <laughs> Depends on whether we ran them in the morning or the day before. Okay. We The dogs always want to go, and they'll run until they can't run anymore. So, if a dog is healthy, is not too old of a dog, it can go every day. Wow. Uh, we generally don't run the same dog in the afternoon if we run it that morning. That makes sense. Okay. So they, they take turns, but we always want the dogs to keep working and be in practice, be in shape. Ooh, these are these are over here are the future the leaders right of the, uh, the quail camp. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, go ahead, break them open, make them safe, and reload. Cool. So, I think they're finding out that this is uh, easier said than done. Guys, okay, you ready? Go get them. Hit them, hunt them up, hunt them up. Oh! Come here, get up! I think you've got a little bit of Come a here. part of its wing. Okay. Yep. Hunt them up. Whoa! So, what do you, what do you think? Down. First quail down. Nice Pretty shot. sick. Nice shot. Hey. So, they've got a lot of wind to battle for their first time doing this, but I'm impressed, man. Great job. Hunt him up. Woo! Oh. Yeah. Good boy, good boy. Okay, back in here. Yeah, Drake, come here. You all right? Yeah. Pop it open. Yeah. Oh, this one kicks him. You must have the one that shells up. You did good not shooting. Yeah. I like that. You did good. Okay, open them up. All right. So we're at the second stop. Uh, you shot two. He killed one, injured one. So we got three birds in the bucket. You guys feeling good? Mm -hmm. Yep. Feeling a little confident for the second round? Yes, sir. So you got to, let's see if we can go up. 
more than three on this round, all right? Yeah. Go get him! Get him, Joey! Get him, Nelson! Hunt him up! Get him up! Get him! Hunt him up! Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Nice! Bring it here, Nelson! Come here! Bring it here, Nelson! Bring it here! We'll take it. Now, now what you guys stay, stay, stay ready to shoot, okay? Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Great shot! Welcome again, make it safe. Hey! That was yeah, a long Joey. shot, Brady! Yeah, that was a yeah, great shot! Yeah, that thing was out there. Get him, Nelson! Get him, Milton. Drop too low now. Come here, Joey. Come here, Joey. Come here, Joey. Come, Joey. Get him, Joey. Go get him. Go get him. The birds have already been flushed, so they're going to come quick, probably. Get him. Get him, Milton. 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 Get him. Hurry up. Get him. Oh, he got him. <laughs> Bring it here, Nelson. There's another one Bring in there, isn't there? Yeah, there's another one over there. Mickey, don't shake a second. Bring it here. Come here. Be ready. Go for it. Get him, Nelson. Get him. Woo! Double, double. Oh, oh, I thought you were going to get a double. <laughs> That was a perfect opportunity of the double. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that would have been sick. Alright, let's go. Still not down in other. Yeah. 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 Come here, Drake. Come here, Drake. Come here. 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 Come Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Get him, Drake! Oh, now that's another lock. Come on, come on, Luke! I'll take him safe. Here we go. Ready? They got one over here, too. A double. Huh? Oh, Get him, Richard. Bring him here. Bring him, buddy. Bring him here. Bring him here. Go for it, bring it. Nice! Hey! Yeah! How about a double for the bun bun boy? Hey, that's right. Grab it. Alright, you wanna let you wanna get in on it? Right? Alright, there's one more here and there's one out there. Let's go, let's go take it. You got that one? You almost had your double. Come on! Alright, so we're on our way back from the quail hunt. And if that wasn't amazing enough, I literally had to tell you, stop the cart. I don't know if you can see over my shoulder, but there is a buck that's, you said, probably a year old. old. Yeah. And if, if, I don't know if we captured it on camera, but the rack on this thing is remarkable. So I can only imagine what your trophy bucks look like. My lease, that thing, not be walking around for long, I can <laughs> promise you. So, phenomenal, amazing. You just don't know what you're gonna see out here. There's all kinds of animals, trophy animals, walking around on this property. All right, so I, I see you're snipping the legs off. Now, when we were here for the, the tower hunt, so is the processing of the quail 
essentially the same where you're clipping the wings, the head comes off, the very similar the to feet the come off, and then you're basically taking the the breast meat out or the body out from the feathers from there? Or how well, the customer tells me what I want, what they want to do. If they want to just have the breast meat or if they want the whole bird. We can find that out before I start cleaning them. Mm -hmm. um, and they dictate where we're going to clean them. Mm -hmm. Some people, I would say the bulk of the people want the whole bird, but some people want just the breast meat. Gotcha. So that determines how we clean them. What now, like, when you prepare these for yourself, what, how do you do it? What do you keep? I, I do both. Mm -hmm. uh, I love deep fried quail. Mm -hmm. You just can't beat them and, and I do both. Okay. Yeah. I mean, is this almost like the bird version of like pulling the skin off of like a dolphin? Like fish wise or? I don't know why I never thought about it, but yeah. Yeah. Kind of. Huh. Okay. Yeah. So, so what happens here? I just right at the base of his breast bone right there. I grab that and I peel the skin. All the way over his back, come all the way over with it, and I get whatever little pieces of there I got. Then I take these snips and I start here. I go on both sides of his backbone. Then I take all the insides out. And that's all I do to it right now until I go to wash them and clean them. Okay. okay. So you guys really like, don't leave any of the details out. I mean, he cleaned our birds beautifully as you see in this video. And then we get this insulated Florida hunting adventure. Does, does every customer go home with something like this? If they want it. If they want it. Fantastic. We do um, everything for you, but cook them. <laughs> well, <laughs> have to cook them. and you've made some good recommendations. So <laughs> again, so this is, this is trip number two for us out here and there'll be more to come. We're so excited to have you guys a part of our tournaments and what we're doing. Uh, the Sailfish Series is getting ready to kick off and all of these teams are fired up about the champions hunting package that we put together. Um, but again, so for those of you guys that are watching this video, I guess the one thing that I would say that was really most valuable to me is the time that I got to spend together with my boys. I wasn't even on the gun that much today. I just got to watch them enjoy God's creation in a beautiful day. And guys, moms, dads, get your kids outdoors. I don't care if it's on the water. I don't care if it's in the woods. There's no better place to spend quality time with your children than right here in this Type of a place and so to you I, I pleasure I, to have you I can't thank you enough um, for allowing us to be here what do you guys think great time absolute blast what was your favorite part watching the dogs work on the birds it yeah. was what about you? I thought you were gonna say it was uh, Susan's uh, ice cream uh. sandwich there inside <laughs> the food is phenomenal which is just another example and so again um, we've been here for pheasant We've just done the quail thing. I can't wait to jump in a deer stand, but we're coming back uh, with... We had so much fun that some of the guys from our group the last time booked the entire tower hunt for February. So we can't wait to come back for that. And I know we talked about it a little bit more, but um, other exciting things that you have to offer for people watching the video, what should they know about this ranch? And what should they know about what makes you guys unique and special? Our number one goal, other than safety, is you arrive as a client and leave as a friend. You can have shot the biggest deer on the ranch and you didn't leave as a friend, Jamie, you somewhat failed. It's great having you guys. I, I take that to heart because I consider Thank you. you guys great friends. So on behalf of uh, Blue Water Movements and Fish Blue Water, we hope you enjoyed another uh, video, changing it up again. Water, woods, we're gonna do it all. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know uh, what you'd like to see next. Give these guys a follow on social media. It's Florida, how do they find you guys? FloridaHuntingAdventures.com. Uh, .com is the website, and we'll see you for the next Fish Blue Water video.